Hello, and welcome, and today we are playing uh, Little Hope, because obviously we've been playing Man of Medan, and this is the next in the series. We have, and it is. Hello there, and Little Hopey Halloween, because it's Halloween today. Yay! <coughs> Ooh, what's all this then? So... Yeah, we're going to be playing this. So this is to come out on the same day as, I believe, part four of Man of Medan. Let's say yes, because... Yeah, sounds sounds about right. Give that a watch at all, if you won't mind. <laughs> so, ah, how are we doing? You all right, pal? I'm not too bad, mate. I'm actually quite excited for this after what we did with Man of Medan. Well, that episode's not gone out yet. <laughs> it's okay. I can, ble I can bleep all this out. I can bleep all this out. Don't you worry. However, so, on that was... note, let's continue the story. Yes. Yes, we shall. Um... Before Rich makes any other <laughs> blunders. <laughs> Note to self, don't mention anything about the past game. Well, it's certainly a game. And that's all I've got to say on that subject. This is a game. Um, thank you for that <laughs> mind-blowing revelation there. I think that's what you'll call a uh, revolutionary insight there. Oh, that Wicker Man style thing in the O there. I would not trust that diner because it looks like it might as well be on wheels. It does look like it used to be a uh, railway carriage at some point. Mm. Or something of the sort. Wild magic, eh? <clears throat> I mean, I'm no, like, Bus driver, but when you shut the door first after you get on it, just so nobody walked on, you know. Yeah, you probably it. would do. I think uh, in American buses, though, they've got like a button, haven't they? What do you mean a button? You mean to shut the door? So, or? Yeah, that's like. Well, yeah, every bus has is. that. Especially stopping at CD diners like that. Yeah. When did all these people get on this bus? He was on his own a minute ago. He was. Maybe some time has passed. Some time later. The music feels very tense already, and I'm already getting like Silent Hill vibes with all this fog. Yeah. Oh, Why is there a police officer in the middle of the sodding road? Uh, Mad Bands. Oh, he's shut Ruid. Why does he need what to, are you like, saying, pal? Why does he need to stand there with it? He doesn't look well, so him. <laughs> yeah, good on here, pal. What's the good word? Bird is the word. Thanks for pulling over. Sure. Something wrong? We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. We've had to close the road. Right. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short. But it depends if, we're, if they live on the friggin' road that you closed off. Yeah, that's Head up the east true. road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. Almost no time and no time are two completely different things, mate. They are. Saying almost. almost. And then it's like an hour later. It's like... What's the saying go? Almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. I have no idea. Is that a saying? Is that a thing? I think so. 
I'll have to look it up and see what it actually means. Cause I've heard it, but I'm not really too sure on the specific what it means. Like. You rub that chip any harder, it'll wear away to nothing. How long have you been sober? He's shy of three months. Impressive. I heard the first 90 days are the toughest and roughest. I know it doesn't add up, but I get something. You can clean that sign. Oh, ah, it is a bit filthy, that isn't it? Going the wrong way. It's fine, just a quick detour. It's not fine. Calm down. It's all okay. Oh, please, John, could you not patronize me? Can you keep it down, please? Keep it down now, they're unconscious. Most no time at all, my heart. Oh, your bearing's been updated. Me when I did nothing. It's just like. <laughs> bearing updated. You are now on your side. <laughs> it's a good bearing. Thanks, game. Oh, it's snowy. Snowy. Oh god, it's the it's the house from um, Home Alone. Oh god. Stop it, Shane. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Can you believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after ten beers. Reverend Carson held her back after prayers today. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together Sam. is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough You're this is You're not the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. Okie doke. Well... <laughs> Not tonight. No way. What did you just call me? Ah, it is Massachusetts. Is late. She always is these days. Um, left. Yeah, it did say it was Massachusetts. I was going to ask a good time. Um, if this is Boston. If this sounded pretty Boston. I'm worried about that guy's no good for her. Yeah, I guess all that new age bullshit reminds me of some creepy cult. What year do you, do you think we're in? Mid eighties? Last week, we shot the breeze a little Maybe bit. Maybe seventies. I like him. That one's a classic, legendary vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? Oh, heavens. <clears throat> hey, Bigfoot, find the goddamn vinyl, Left. will you? Come on, man. Take some time off from being a dick and give her a break. Okay, Mother Superior. Why are you always sticking up for her anyway? Start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. How's things? Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again. They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Um, left. The perfect opportunity to go for a disappointment. Who could have guessed it? 
They're always fighting these days, getting predictable. Like a record that keeps playing over and over. Dennis, for the 10 millionth time, will you ship that shit of yours up into the hey, attic? Some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought after collection. All right, happy days. Calm down. <laughs> hey, sit on it. I think she was a Marine sergeant of past life. It's crawled up his ass. Left. Dennis is just being Dennis. Just Dennis doing what he's good at. Being really Dennis. What a surprise. That does not look safe. Don't know how old is it. It's like it could crumble at any Dennis. moment. Hey! Not now, sis. I'm busy. Crazy. Yeah, little girl. <laughs> oh. Jesus, you scared me, sweetheart. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I like to have a bath I in peace. So. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Yeah, she's just a kid who wants to be loved. Yeah. But she's going about it in a very uh, sinister manner. Well, she's a child. It's like she doesn't know any like different. She just wants to be loved. She just doesn't know why. Yeah. Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? It just upsets someone. This sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's the little princess anyway? Uh, right. Probably oh, wait, am I still choosing, or do you want to choose As these ones? Sister, no, it is my one. sworn legal duty yeah, to check well, in on her. Well, right, sure. I'll choose when like you're the law it's around a bit here. speedy. She went yeah, upstairs. that's totally fair. I'll go find her. I guess, uh... <laughs> We had a few close calls last time. Yeah. And that's all I'm going to say on that matter. But, oh, it's a box of matches. I almost thought it was a box of raisins. Sweet, sweet raisins. Ugh, hob kettles. <laughs> I was thinking more, oh, gas cookers. <laughs> Nothing wrong with a gas cooker. Not a fan. Oh, it's uh, the heartbeat meter is back. The heartbeater, if you will. Oh, nice trainers. I've got them. It's different. Did you change button? Yeah. I can't see that becoming an issue later at all. Wait. Did that TV remote have like... You need to keep an eye on your little sister. A uh, wood board. Mum is real worried about her. Right. It's okay, Dad. Tanya's checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? The devil himself would struggle with you guys. Yeah, you're no prize turkey either, mate. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? I'm not looking to save the world. I'm not looking for New England. Good for you. <laughs> I'm not, you know. I know roughly where it is. Use R to look around. Look harder, Lenny. And it's not there. To the untrained eye, yes. And also to the trained eye. Nothing there. To say that these people are... Um... 
perfect distraction like, uh, from this madhouse. Well, well, what I assume is fairly religious. They have a lot of, like, witch hunt stuff. Yeah. Which, you know. Yeah, they, they could be religious. Um, I guess we'll find out. Is he asleep still? <laughs> Just fell back asleep. Open. Oh, doors wank. They have improved the uh, motion control. Have they? Of the game, yeah. It does look a lot smoother. Son of a bitch, Clark. Look, oh, this, I... is a, this is a lot smoother. Oh, yeah. oh, mate, do a spin. Do a spin. Oh. Wow. Megan is in even more trouble. I mean, let's I be thought. honest. Below 70. I mean, you know that. What? Is, is that a thing in America? I don't know. I don't know the uh, score system. That's... No, surely not. Did that say anything below 70 is a D? Or like a fail? It's an F. Anthony, yeah. where the hell are you? It's almighty. Anthony, where are you, goddammit? Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off. She's gonna lock him out. Which one's Anthony? Are you Anthony? You could be right about my family. I think so oh. too. Tanya, what's going on? That little brat locked me out. It's fucking freezing. All right, she's just gonna put a kettle on for a. Uh... Oh. I'll let you back in. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. I'm sorry, but that wouldn't happen like that. That's why you don't Shit. have carpet in the kitchen. You in there? It's not carpet. It's that wino. The kitchen's on fire! Are you fucking serious? Do I nobody likes hob kettles? It sounds like it's ready though. <laughs> the scree. <laughs> Safe though, like basically you should just have to break open the window. And be out yeah. Where the hell is everybody? Anthony! Help! Oh no, Dennis's vinyls! In pal. There's a shovel on there. That's a bad way. So now it goes back to you, what do you do? Um, um, help Megan. Tanya, hold on! I 
gotta get Megan out. Megan! Why did she run upstairs? Was was that Megan? Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, don't go in. Why is she going into a burning building? She was literally like, a f like seven foot off the floor. She could have just dived off the edge into the snow. Oh yeah, definitely could have made that. Maybe we uh, an injury or two. He's going to fall off and break his neck, isn't he? Oh, not his neck. That can't have been nice. No. Oh, I would say not very pleasant death. This hall again. Almost forgot about that. They do pick some good music. Yeah, they do. Well, Polter, that's where I know that guy from. Yeah, he's the. Um, he was in Maze Runner, weren't he? He was, and perhaps most famously from the "You guys are getting paid" meme. Yeah. Wait, is this the same music from the last one? Possibly, I'm not sure. Either way, it's still good. Yeah, it's, it's still pretty damn good, isn't it? Uh, hey, it's what's his chops? I'd like to the, see how he ties into it all. The curator or whatever he's called. Yeah. He had like a, um, I feel like, descriptive sort of job title going on, didn't he? Yeah, but he was... Um, Cheers, he wasn't, Supermassive? He wasn't in, like, in the story of the last one. You, you just no. saw him every so often, so I'd like to see if he tied into the story in any way. Yeah. Well, I've heard this is... Well, this is the sequel to Man of Medan, but I've heard that there's eight like, they're planning to release all together, I think. Is that? Well, either way, I'd like to play them, because uh, I do love these sort of games, because when they did Until Dawn, it was amazing. And then Man at Medan was just as good. I'll have to get that a whack at some point. You said it's good, haven't you, Phil? Hello. All right, pal. And welcome back. I have a new story for you. It's very different to the last. Close hips go. Shake it. Hips don't lie. I mean, I wouldn't hold that that close to some books. Especially based on what we've just seen. <laughs> Disconcerting, no? I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. This particular story isn't fully fleshed out. It's only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Marry God. The fire. No, there was nothing you could have done about that. What's happened has happened. Or has it? Anyway, look to the future, I say. Life's but a walking shadow, eh? You are about to enter a confusing, perhaps disturbing world. 
how disturbing might depend on what you choose to believe and how confusing on the path you choose to take. There are an infinite number of directions in which one could travel. We seldom have all the information that we'd like, but we have to choose our path nonetheless and hope that we get the clarity and the outcomes that we want. As in life, your decisions will matter. The choices you make will affect others. You've seen how the story starts. So much death. How many more deaths is entirely up to you. It depends on the decisions that you make. What are you? Rational? Emotional? Do you trust your head or your heart? There is no right answer. Sometimes one is best and sometimes, sometimes neither. The other. My <laughs> advice trust your spleen. Is to thine own self be true. Splain Mayor Shane. Splain Mayor Shane. But uh, I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. <clears throat> I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Not my place, apparently. But I am apparently allowed to share wise words from great storytellers that have gone before where I feel that that would be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you go. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future, something that may or may not happen. Use them. They might help you. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. <laughs> Cheers, pal. <laughs> go on, get to a funeral, pal. Cheers, mate. It's raining. There's a lot of snow. None of us here today can understand why cold, this tragic uh, accident like happened. Sleety. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together for eternity in God's loving embrace. Praise the sun. Oh, and it's snowing and raining. You've got to, haven't you? It's going to be the bus crash. <clears throat> Not injured though. Wait, isn't that the same dude? No. Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. <sighs> Instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? Uh, left. How is he doing anyway? Doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. Okay, Professor. Or should I call you doctor now? Why don't you try calling for help? <coughs> Maybe the cops, someone like that. Right. I already tried once, but I'm on it. Hey, Andrew, buddy, how you doing? Where are we? What happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though, just shaking up. If you say so. 
I don't remember being in any crash. You're, you're probably in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there, too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. Oh, and he was the dad. Right, okay. Gotcha. What are you on about? No, he wasn't the dad. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah. Fucking thing, useless piece of like, obviously, it's a different time period, but that oh, guy was the dad. Okay, take and it that easy. Girl was Figure the sister. Out what to do. Mm, no. And Will Poulton was Anthony. As well as being Andrew. Uh. Uh. Oh. I guess so. And that's Dennis. I guess that could be a delusion, though, from the crash. Fuck. Where's my phone? Yeah. Oh no, he's dropped his wallet. Or more importantly, his toad. Abrasive. Abrasive and understanding. Hey, anyone up there? Hey, Daniel, that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Obsessed with Daniel, isn't she? Daniel. Taylor, you okay? I'm good. We're fine too, thanks for asking. You okay down there? I'm alright. Nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John, any idea what caused the crash? Not sure. Looked like the driver swerved to avoid something in the road. He down there, by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back up to us? I think what's weird is that nobody was injured. Yeah, yeah everyone seems down here fine. I can try. Apart Great. from poor old Will Poulton. Take the trail. Sorry, Should take Andrew. you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. <coughs> oh. Hey, Taylor. Help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait. I don't remember anything. R who are you? It's okay. You're concussed. I'm John, you're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. But a crash course. Uh, we'll find the others, get some help. <laughs> Think of it as a character building exercise. <laughs> what happens if you fail that? Do you just like Team pull him up a little place. bit and then drop him? I had this dream. It was so oh, or he doesn't or he tries to do it himself. Flames all around us. It was Grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. That trail the others are on will come out down the road. We'll meet them there. Um, stay in here. I don't think leaving the bus is smart. I'm staying here. You can't stay. No one's been down this road since we crashed. No one knows we're here. Where's the bus driver? Where's the driver? Shouldn't he be back by now? The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. Yeah, left. You're right. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm right? The quicker we get help, the quicker we can all go home. Stick close behind me. So that means you're all going to get lost and separated, obviously. I can't believe the driver... Just taking off like that and ditching us? Maybe you didn't realize. You could just be in shock. You do. For his responsibility, his passengers, <laughs> he can't just stroll off. Oh, was that some sort of uh, motif down there, or was it just plants? It's just plants. Ah, because it's the modern day, because people aren't using torches, because everyone's phone has a torch on it. <laughs> Where does it say that? Abandoned hope. You know this place? Uh, it was all, all like spray painted on underneath. No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know little hope. Curious. Right. Curious. Why should I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. Left. H how do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm a professional academic. I read books, unlike some. <laughs> Easy, Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. 
Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. I mean, he's not wrong, but he was very sassy. Oh no, you didn't. <laughs> Oh, that was promising. Good to see you two. Finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. I was getting worried. I bet you were. This gate has changed. We can't get through. Oh, he's a genius, isn't he? <laughs> Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. Think this'll do it? What a lot. Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, hey, you two. The band's back together. What's the plan now? Head into town, see if we can get help. You know where town is? Sure, Close we're near Little fine. Hope. Sounds like a fun place. Funnily enough, Little Hope does have an interesting and dark um, history. Laughed. Right, which guy? Red shirt. Can we get going without having a smart ass lecture first? I'm starting not to like you or your attitude. I'm not even started yet. You want a little more? <laughs> Try to be civil. Cost nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. He's not my boyfriend. <laughs> You're kidding. He is not my boyfriend. What have you been telling her? I didn't say a thing. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time here. Can we please just keep moving? You think this is a solid plan, heading into town? As good as any. I went along with it before, but I'm not so sure now. So what do you want to do? How about you come with me back to the bus? I'm with the professor on this one. Our best play is heading into town and getting um, some help. Andrew? How about you? You want to head back to the bus with me? Thing is, I think going into town is probably our best shot at finding help. Fine. Come on, Taylor. Don't check out on us. It's a bad idea to be out here walking around alone. Come with us. Don't worry about me. I'll flag down the first car I see and come get you all real soon. Come with us. Are you kidding me? I'm not That's going a anywhere. terrible idea. And then there were four. <laughs> what? what? I walked away from you! Uh-huh. So you thought better of going it alone then. Why'd you come back? I don't get it. Ah, she's Just getting silent and held. Lost in a world of her own. What the hell are you playing at? You going or not? Hey, wait. What are you doing? Taylor. Look out. What the? What's going on with you? Why do you keep coming back? I'm not coming back. I walk straight out every time. It's like, I don't know. I can't fucking leave or something. Okay, let's try something. We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. You want to put us on a kid's line? Okay, okay, I'm coming. <laughs> that didn't say much convincing, did it? Dun, dun, dun. I admit that is a little <laughs> odd. More than a little. It's not possible. It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped. We can't leave here. Now okay. what can we do? Okay, calm down, breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Maybe we all died in the crash. Yeah. Nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. <laughs> Rational. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. Now we're stuck here in little no hope. That is way out of line. 
I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. Are you for fucking real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest um, of us. Right. I'm sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure a way out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Maybe it isn't real. We have to get out of here right now. I need to think straight. Right now. Football coaching. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us Too out right, of here. Too right, pal. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Now let's be logical. The fog is between us and the bus. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we Pains can go to except admit. into that damn town. So, oh, it makes yeah, sense. <laughs> you leaving me? Where are I think you, you see a little uh, Clark on, trait description. She's abrasive. Do we know what's up. Like a brillo pad. Oh, are you in control is. again? Yeah. And on the next episode of Little Hope, we will wander into town, seeing as we can't go back due to some... Magical Unseen Forces. Why did you say so, yeah. I'll be dead? I uh, suppose we you leave it there. Possible? Guess we've already run it a bit long. A, <laughs> a little bit, but it was mostly a cutscene. You know, yeah, that's true. Forget about it. And, what they oh, said okay. didn't stack up. Yeah, I've been Rich. Dex's been actually playing the game. Um... Thank you for joining us. Give us a like, give us subscribe, um, comment on our stuff. That's super helpful. Um, let us know if there's anything else you'd like us to play. And yeah, take care. Have a good one. See you next time. Goodbye.